so far Nintendo has kicked some ass. They remember that WarioWare game we played? They announced a new WarioWare game, the one we played on Nintendo Wii, a new one for Switch, a new Mario Party coming this year, both of those, and um, uh, a new Metroid. All right. This next segment will be our last and announcement of the day. What? Please take a look. Already? Breath of the Wild 2. No, hire warriors. Nah, they're trolling. Nah, they're trolling. They're trolling. That cannot be their last announcement. They've only been doing this for like 40 minutes. Can't even give us an hour? If this is really their last announcement, that's kind of tragic. They have to be trolling. Hyrule Warriors? Nah, they're they're trolling. That can't be real. I have a few more things to share with you all today. Okay. We'll begin with the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD game. Yeah. Launches. Next up. Dude, they're trolling. Come on. Nintendo found another way to uh, release Legend of Zelda and make more money on it. All right. Here's the last thing we have to show you. This is the sequel to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. All right. This is big. Going to come out like another four years. All right. This is kind of big. And that's it. <laughs> it just says 2022. <laughs> oh, shit. Whoa, what is up with his arm? Dude's got like a... He's got like a prosthetic. Was this Angel Island from Sonic? Nice. Oh, we're not even gonna get any remotely. It's gonna be no release date at all. So, 2022, what? So 2023, basically, is when it's gonna come out. So, what did you think? This time around, the setting for the adventure has been expanded to include the skies above Hyrule. We'd like to Yeah, it looked like more like sky gameplay. I really I want to watch the Breath of the Wild trailer again. That's all I really want to watch. So, it doesn't look like it's Ganon this time. Which that's fine. Give me a new villain. It was like the first thing I noticed right off the bat was his arm. And it's like yeah, a lot more like of the sky you can explore. It seems like they took the Breath of the Wild engine and just added more onto it, which that's what they should do. <laughs> New abilities and everything. Dude, they just need to make the last boss good. Or at least the main villain. I, in Breath of the Wild 1, I did not like the final fight. It was so lame. Calamity Gammon was like nothing. You didn't really. He wasn't much of a threat. He was such an easy fight. Especially if you actually did the story of the game. Because that was like the whole thing. If you just went and fought him right off the bat, he is hard as hell. But if you do the story, then he's easy. And then we'll listen to Dragon Ball Z Kodakai Tenkaichi 3 Hot Soul Music.